I am such a bad snake owner. It's been two weeks, I think, since this guy has eaten. I don't know why. It's such an easy thing. Just drop a little mouse in, but I've been really busy with other stuff, so definitely getting fed today. with me. Alrighty. Turn around. All right, Rebecca is off again. Uh, she's doing, let's see, yesterday was singing at a yoga class. Today is yoga of sound. I don't totally know exactly what it is. I think it's something about using your voice to uh, tap into certain I don't know, it's like a healing modality, I think. Molly plans for the day are play with my snake, feed him. Play with my snake. Let's <laughs> say that again. <laughs> play with Labby, the, the ball python, an actual snake. Feed him, because I have not fed him in so long. And play video games with my boys. Yeah. Well, Rebecca's teaching healing modalities. I'm going to play video games. There's nothing wrong with video games. I like video games. They're fun. And I enjoy doing that with my boys because we have a lot of fun doing that together. But there's also a need for something a little more grounded. Now, it's freaking hot outside again, so we're probably not going to be running around out there. But what we will do, we're going to meditate together. I have to say that quietly because my oldest one says meditation freaks him out and he can't handle it. I know what's true for him. But what we are going to do is this. I don't know if you can see that. This is an app called Headspace. Something about this guy's voice. He does a great job. A lot of meditation. Almost 95%. That's a factual number of guided meditation. The voices really suck. They just don't have good resonance in their voice and they don't sound really good to listen to while you're trying to go into a very centered space. They kind of take you out because they're either too nasally or um, or they're just trying too hard to be, you know, breathy and, and uh, spiritual. Here's the deal. We are going to sit here and meditate before, and then after that, we can go and, and sort of play some rounds of, of games, okay? Before you get started, here are a few tips to help you get the most from the exercise. All right, that was not too bad. 10 minute meditation for kids could be really difficult, but they did pretty good. So, off to video games. Hey, wait, wait, wait. I'm right here. Hey, 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 hey. Oh, hey, God, wait. Oh, sorry. This is very stressful. Ah! 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 <laughs> oh, God, don't put me in a real war. Third. I got third. You got I'll third. I'll high five for that. <laughs> this game is fun. Man, it is. It is it's stressful. Intense. It's intense. You just have to know what you're doing. Whoa. I know. It's, it's a... the RoboCop guys. What? Can we, we, we can't take those? No, you can't take them and you can't go past them either. Ah. Run! We won? Okay. 22, I got six deaths. We both got one assist. All right, I'm gonna take a break. Yeah, we know. You go ahead. Okay, remember to
So the thing with snakes is that you're not really supposed to feed them in the terrarium. Uh, it's because you don't want them to associate this home with eating ever. But I don't know. I just never followed that rule with this guy and he's a total sweetheart. He's always done a great job um, at never biting anybody in or out of the terrarium and he's wonderful at eating. Fast car, playing. Fast car. 